Batinda, aiming to encourage the coal-fired thermal power plants adopting green norms for cleaner air. Center for Science and Environment CSE, has stressed the need to call those plants as first-run plants. These plants will require a certificate from the Pollution Control Board to certify that they are complying or are suitably advanced in the direction to comply with the December 2015 environmental norms, mainly in emissions of PM, SO2, and NO2. A ranking of first-run power stations will have to be made and power procured from them on priority. CSE has also urged to increase penalties for those power plants which are not showing any interest in adopting such norms to decrease emission. CSE on Wednesday released a report in a webinar about thermal power plants likely to miss green norm deadline of year 2022, going by the progress made so far. Chairman, Economic Advisory Council to Prime Minister, Bibek De Broy, Power Secretary Sanjeev Nandan Sahai, NTPC CMD Gurdeep Singh, Adani Transmission MD and CEO Anil Sardana attended the webinar and put up government viewpoint. CSE categorized the power generation as per flu gas desulfurization FGD norms. According to it 57,624 megawatts coal likely to meet target which has been put in yellow category, 140,940 megawatts likely to miss the target and has been put in orange category, 7,450 megawatts is sure to miss target and has been put in red category, said CSE DG Sunita Narain. According to the current regulations, the current penalty of Rs 30,000 to 50,000 per megawatts for not complying is not high enough to serve any purpose. To tackle this, CPCB will need to step in and modify penalty provisions. CSE suggested a fine of 20 lakh rupees per megawatt, said Nivit K. Yadav, Program Director, Industrial Pollution CSE. Coal-based power is one of the most resource-intensive and polluting industries and coal power plants emit 60% of the total particulate matter, 45% of total sulfur dioxide, 30% of total nitrogen oxides and more than 80% of the total mercury emitted by all industries in India. To contain the pollution caused by coal-based power plants, Ministry of Environment Forest and Climate Change MOEFCC, introduced stricter environmental standards for coal-based plants on December 7, 2015 under the Environment Protection Act, 1986. All thermal plants were required to comply with the revised standards by December 2017, but the deadline was pushed to 2022. CSE analysis reveals that even after five years of announcing these norms, most plants have not taken adequate action and have not yet made significant progress and going by the progress this deadline may not be met by 70% of the installed capacity of total 2.06.014 MW. It seems that 30% of the capacity is still striving to meet the norms. Apart from 2. 06 lakh MW, installed capacity of renewable power stations in the country is 86, 400 megawatts. Please support our channel to grow by pressing subscribe button as well as the bell icon for environment updates. Thank you.